Hey guys, A here. So, um, if you didn't know, The Sims 4 Get to Work came out about, I don't know, a week ago? Not a week ago. Three weeks ago. Two weeks ago? I don't know when it came out, but I got it. And I'm ready to play. I'm super excited. Um, so, yeah. Sorry I haven't uploaded in a long time. I'm working really hard on Big Brother. And... Yeah, that's basically all I've been doing for like the past month, so um, I really wanted to play this, so I thought I would just, you know what, well, why not, just let's start a new LP, even though I already have like four other ones going, but that's okay, because the more the better, right, the more the merrier, yeah, okay, well, um, so The Sims 4 Get to Work is the first expansion pack, um, to come out for The Sims 4, and, yeah, it's kind of like Ambitions for The Sims 3. Anyways, I'll stop talking now. Let's meet our Sims. This is Rachel McDowell. She's very, very pretty. Do a little spin. And everything she is wearing is from either the base game or Get to Work. This hair, oh, and, um... If you are interested in seeing the content for this expansion, I'm sure someone else on YouTube has like showcased it. I don't really feel like going through it right now, but this hair comes with the expansion pack. Um, well, uh, her eyebrows are custom content. Her lips are base game. Are they? I don't know. Her makeup is probably all custom content because CC makeup is the best. Anyways, her top and her bottom are both from Get to Work. Very cute. So is her bracelet. Her sandals are from the base game. So that is Rachel. I'll go ahead and show you her other outfits. This is her formal. Super cute. Hair is custom content, so is the dress. I'm <laughs> just saying. Okay. Um, athletic. The beanie also came with Get to Work. Super cute. So did the sweatshirt. Super cute. <laughs> um, this is her sleepwear. Party. This romper came with the Sims 4 Get to Work. Also very cute. Very deep v-neck. Sexy. Scandalous. Yeah. And this is her swimwear. Oh, look at this bow. It's so cute. I love it custom content anyways who doesn't love custom content anywho um she is going to be my retail shop owner so i'm basically going to have her focus on all the skills that were introduced in the expansion and then once we have enough money i will open a retail store whether that's a bakery a electronic store a clothing store um i will let you guys decide that or i will just see what fits her later on but um right now her aspiration is to be a master chef which means she has an essence of flavor loves the outdoors is neat and a foodie so that is rachel up next we have william roos he is pretty pretty fancy huh um yeah pretty good looking if I do say so myself. Um, he is also wearing things from Get to Work. This sweatshirt is from Get to Work as you can see here. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure his pants are from the base game. And this is his formal wear. Very cute. No, not cute. Handsome. Very handsome. Athletic wear. Sleepwear. You can see his uh, his pectorials. Pectorials. Is that how you say it? Well, those. His abs is basically what I mean. Party wear. I gave him little glasses because I think he looks cute in glasses. <laughs> and then swimwear. So that's William. Willem. Um. He wants to have a big happy family. He is domestic. A geek goofball and family orientated and because he likes family I decided to make him the doctor so that's who William is and Damon 
is uh, this rebel right here. Um, I used the beanie from Get to Work, and his hair is also from this expansion. I'm pretty sure his shirt is too. Yeah. So this is everyday wear. Formal. Athletic. Sleep. Party. And swimwear. So Damon is, or wants to be, a chief of mischief. He is dastardly, self-assured, outgoing, and childish, and he will be my detective. And last but not least, is Iris, my lovely, lovely alien. Um, if you didn't know, Get to Work came with the addition of aliens, so now you can add a sim, but you can also add alien, which is really, really cool. Um, so this is Iris. She is pretty beautiful. Her makeup is on point. Um, you can't really pick any clothes for them. It's just like these suits. Oh, you could have like regular clothes, but that's boring. You gotta give them one of the suits. Um, so basically all of her outfits are the same thing, so I'm not gonna go through her outfits, but yes, she is, or oh my god, she wants to be a nerd brain. She is a quick learner, a genius, ambitious, and creative. So this is Iris Landis. <laughs> Isn't Landis a cool last name? Because she's like an alien, you know, like land, it's opposite of space. I don't know. I thought that was pretty funny. I just randomized that last name and it happened to pop up. So this is Iris. I think she's super cute. And she is going to be the scientist. So yeah, those are all my characters. And let's go ahead and hop right into the game. Alright, so I just wanted to show you the addition of the new world. It is extremely small. It's not very exciting at all. There's only one empty lot and three lots that are pre-built. Um, they are all stores. So yeah, that's kind of underwhelming. But um, I want to go ahead and move to Willow Creek because I love Willow Creek. It's it's beautiful. A beautiful place. Um, and let's see here. I think I might build a house because I've been in all three of these houses too many times and it just gets so old. So... Uh, ooh. 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 Oh my god, that's so expensive. <laughs> I like this neighborhood because, you know, we have, like, all these little cool houses over here. But this one's cheaper. So, you know, I'm just gonna go for this one. No. Yes? No. I don't know. Anyways, I will pick one and try my best to build something somewhat decent and I will I'll be back <laughs> okay so I am back and I did my best to build an okay house I have all the essentials and I think I did okay um I still have 500 simoleons left so I think I did a pretty good job um uh in terms of like not spending too much um for some reason the door won't show up but there's a door there I promise if we go down there the door will show up, but, um, I will show you the house, so, let's pause this, over here is our little mini living room with the teeny weeny TV, and, um, we have a kitchen over here, dining room, and then I made the two bedrooms so that they both connected to one bathroom, so this is the guy's room, this is the girl's room, and then the bathroom's in the middle. So, that's <laughs> basic. Oh, and I got a computer. Um, but that's basically it. It's pretty simple. Um, got all the necessities. So, yeah. Um, the first thing we should do is obviously get the jobs. Um, let's see. 
Rachel will be unemployed because she, ooh, text. She will have, um, uh, she will have, sorry, I was reading the text. Um, <laughs> she will, what was I saying? Um, oh, oh, right, she will be the retail owner. Um, <laughs> but William, Damon, and Iris will all join a career. So, let's go ahead and do that, please. Okay, William is going to be the doctor. So, it says, who doesn't want to be held responsible for another Sim's health and well-being? A doctor who can advance in the medical ranks will find themselves rewarded with objects like a standing surgical light and a full-size skeleton to brighten up the home nursery. To make the deal extra sweet, you'll be able to unlock your very own hospital scrubs and patient gowns so you can play doctor at home. Cool, cool. Oh my gosh, everyone's discovering that Iris is an alien. <laughs> um, Damon will be a detective, so this one says, Do you want to be the type of cop who's never really off duty? If so, this job's for you, and we've got the rewards to support that unhealthy lifestyle. Unlock outfits like your police uniform to wear as pajamas. Teach your teen a valuable lesson for that C-plus by dressing them in prisoner coveralls and transforming their bedroom into a virtual jail cell. Compete, complete, compete, complete with prison bars, walls. Okay, wait one sec. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. My mom walked in, and it's kind of awkward, you know, when you're talking to your computer screen, and one of your family members interrupts you. Anyways, um, not quite sure where I was reading, but, um, you can, you can just read the rest on your own. So, yeah, Damon's gonna be a detective, <laughs> and Iris is gonna be a scientist. And it says, calling all brains. Are you the nerdy type who aspires to be one day... Oh my god. Is someone else coming now? Okay, no, I think we're good. Anyways. <laughs> um, to one day wear tinfoil on your head and decorate your studio with huge bubbly tanks. A scientist who proves they've got the gray matter to change the world as we know it can unlock new outfits like the UFO hunter or objects like swanky, like the swanky... Like, oh, I was covering the A. Like a swanky chemistry lab for concocting new inventions and serums. Cool, cool. Well, everyone knows that Iris is an alien now, so I guess there aren't any secrets in this house. Um, I don't know why I just paused it. Um, don't mind me. I'm kind of off my game today. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Okay. Well, um, I think I'm going to alter Iris's disguise, so I'll do that and show you when I'm done. Okay, so I just wanted to really quickly show you Iris's disguise. Um, this is her. I tried to make her really bold. Um, so like a really bold hair color and like I used the alien blush but like made it more natural but it still looks pretty like different um, like bold makeup and bold clothing choices and you'll see you'll see it better later but she has a tattoo right here I thought that'd just be kind of cool because you know she's different um, for her formal wear it's just this little dress and I made her lips pop and here you can see the tattoo better, and it did come with Get to Work. Um, this is her athletic wear. Sleep. Party. And some wear. So, this is Iris in her human disguised form. Very, very pretty. Alright, so obviously the most important addition to the game is the addition of selfies. Um, this is so, so important. I 
why didn't I start off with this? Um, obviously we're gonna have to take a selfie, like right now. Um, let's have Rachel take one with Iris, the ladies of the house. Yeah, I'm gonna start a selfie wall like every other person doing an LP is, but you know what? That's okay. I'm a follower. And yeah, I'm not gonna hide it. I'm a follower. So, Nia is super cute. Um, let's pick a filter. Okay, I'm gonna sneeze. I apologize in advance. Wait. Ooh, text. Uh, uh, okay, I'll come later. <laughs> um, hmm. Ooh, that one's nice and bright. Oh, this one makes Iris look like a goddess. Oh, I feel it coming again. I like the bright one. Let's go for that one. Take two, just in case it gets messed up. Alright. Let's see. Let's see how these turned out. Where should I s our selfie wall be? Hmm. Oh, we have this nice blank area right here. Okay. Take a look see. Oh, <laughs> so this one turned out good, but Rachel has her thumb in this one, so we'll put that one away. Sweet first addition to our selfie wall. But I can't put it over here, which is weird. Probably because the door. So we'll start it on the side. <laughs> okay, cool. So, I'm pretty sure this was really, really short part, but I think I'm going to go ahead and end it here. I mean, we met our characters, we got our jobs, and the next part we're probably going to go to work with William first, because he starts the earliest, right? Um, 7 a.m., 8 a.m., 10 a.m., yeah, I think we're going to go for William first, and yeah i'm really excited um if you like this video please give it a thumbs up don't forget to comment rate and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video bye guys